Hi, I'm Carla Buderak and welcome to Behavior Communicates. Do you ever find that you tend to use the materials you have over and over again for the same situations or the same kind of student? I know I do. I'm going to encourage you to think about using a tool you may already have in your toolbox and try using it on your child with oppositional defiant disorder. Even though you have used the first and then strategy, let me show you how this can work for the child with ODD. Here's a typical first and then visual that you can use when your student is refusing to complete an assignment. You simply put the thing that you require first and the reward second in front of the child. You can use a verbal direction with it like finish reading, then iPad. I recommend that you present the first and then only twice. I can't guarantee that it won't get thrown or tossed on the floor, but the second time you present it, do it visually only. Say nothing, just point. We teach children that when someone speaks to you, we expect a response. We expect that reciprocity in conversation, right? So when one person talks and finishes, then the door is open for the next person to respond. Our kids with ODD use that opening to tell you no or to defy you. If you just place the first and then card in front of a child and then point and then walk away, they do not have that opening to be oppositional. If they still don't comply, just walk away. They know what you're asking and what the reward is. The choice is theirs. Thank you so much for joining me here at Behavior Communicates. Just remember, the more we know about how to help the child or the students we love, the better quality of life they will have. If you like this video and you want to be in the know, sign up for Behavior Communicates. You'll automatically get my weekly video and blog plus other resources that I only share with my subscribers. Please share this video with your parents, teachers, coworkers, and friends on Facebook, Twitter, and all your other social media. You take care and I'll see you next time.